Hi, my name is Lloyd Dixon. I'm the project manager for the Mill Pond Dam Removal Project. We're located on Sullivan Creek in Northeast Washington in Pend Oreille County. The Mill Pond Dam Removal Project is a multi-phase project which ultimately will provide a restored channel, improved fish passage, and recreational opportunities for visitors and locals alike. Our license um, release conditions said the dam needed to be removed and other restoration measures needed to happen. Seattle City Light had to renew their license to operate Boundary Dam. They had requirements to do the similar restoration measures, so it worked really well for both entities to team up and get this project done. The project has three primary goals. One is to restore passage for aquatic organisms and connect the lower reaches of Sullivan Creek to the upper reaches. Number two is this dam has not generated power since 1956, and it's a long-term safety and infrastructure risk that needs to be removed for that reason. And number three, to restore natural riverine processes in this reach of river. So the first phase of this is really a process of discovery. We are attempting to discover the old channel, the channel that was here historically to poke our way down through 100 years of accumulated sediments to find that historic channel and to connect the dots so that we can create a stream and channel floodplain with high habitat value through its entire course that's, that's going to sustain itself. Right now we are sitting on Mill Pond, just behind the Mill Pond Dam, uh, which is in the process of being removed. Um, the first stages of which was removing a, an existing pedestrian bridge that spanned over the dam. Subsequent to that, we began work removing a log crimp dam, which was just beneath the surface and just behind uh, Mill Pond Dam, which prevented us from bringing heavy equipment in here. Part of taking down the dam is motivating 100 years worth of collected sediments from behind the dam. So we'll use the waters from Lake Sullivan above us to flush the sediment through the diversion channels that we've cut into the delta above the pond. Along with that, we're gonna be using high pressure water cannons to rinse sediments from the perimeter of the pond down into Mill Pond and eventually out through the, uh, through the dam itself. Next year, we're gonna come back and install log jams throughout the pond. Those log jams are gonna create scour pools, habitat features that fish will be, they'll grow and raise inside those scour pools. So really, the great fisheries benefit is gonna come after next year's work. And then we're gonna bring in plants, thousands and thousands of plants that are gonna go across the entire landscape. We will also be constructing a looping trail system. There will be a bridge that passes over Mill Pond Dam, goes up into the hills, and then drops down up by the, the campground area to create a circuit that goes all the way around Sullivan Creek. There's a lot of scientists and engineers, geomorphologists, hydrologists, biologists, who've been working really hard day and night to bring together the design, working with Seattle City Light hand in glove for a long time. We're off to a great start, and I'm confident you're gonna love it when we're done.